Hello, everybody. Welcome back to our summer fun educational series. Jen here, your host at Natural Wellness Tips. Um, I'm really excited to talk to you guys about the next topic. Uh, my goal really with this whole page and community that I've created is to help empower people to know that they can live their best life in a natural way and not have to always turn to pharmaceuticals or over the counters and just really know that there's other options out there. So today I want to talk to you about those anxious feelings. Me and my team have been working hard on creating these little protocol sheets uh, that walk you through kind of the regimen we recommend for different things. And we're going to go through the one for anxious feelings today. Uh, so I'm going to talk to you about some of my favorite products and kind of how I like to use them and how they've worked for me and how they've worked for people that I've helped and supported. So one of the first things I recommend is Copaiba. So Copaiba is a essential oil that comes from a tree down in the Brazilian rainforest in South America. Uh, it is an incredible essential oil. So many of you have probably heard of CBD oil. CBD oil is what we call an endocannabinoid. So we have an endocannabinoid system in our body, and it's one of the many systems that function in our body. And we have R1 and R2 receptors. R1 receptors reside in our, our brain, uh, and those are what cause the hallucinations off of like THC and things, the, the high. Uh, R2 receptors are throughout the body, and they support the physiological body. So that's where your CBD oil is affecting, those R2 receptors. So the people that report having some support with discomfort or even with neurological things uh, like seizures and things, they're using CBD for those type of things. And that's when the CBD is interacting with the R2 receptors. So copaiba is a, is a endocannabinoid as well, similar to CBD. It's not CBD oil. It doesn't come from the marijuana plant. It comes from a sap of a tree in the Brazilian rainforest. But it affects the endocannabinoid system similar to a CBD oil. So this is an all-natural option uh, that you can turn to if you don't want to turn to that CBD oil. I love CBD oil. I think it's incredible. Um, it's just I love this oil just as much, if not way more. So this is one of the things that you can use to help with those anxious feelings. So as like a daily regimen or daily routine, you can take copaiba and you put a drop just like that under your tongue. Um, I, you get used to the taste. It's not bad. If you don't like the taste, you can go ahead and pop that in these nice little veggie caps. So veggie capsules are fabulous. They have a large and a small end, and you put the oils in the large end, and then you put the small end on top, and then you can take it like a pill. So you can put your copaiba in there. Uh, I've heard of people using, I have a friend that uses it for her dog. She puts a drop in his food every day to just help support him as he ages. Uh, and that works really well. So it works the same for humans. Uh, so when you're using it for those anxious feelings under your tongue, you're going to get other added benefits, which is fabulous. But this really just whew, settles you down. It is so relaxing. So this is such a great oil for, for those anxious feelings. I like to combine it with my frankincense. So frankincense, uh, again, drop under the tongue. Uh, minimum once a day is kind of my routine. If you're dealing with a more stressful situation, uh, you know that you're going to be in, maybe you're on stage talking in front of people, or maybe you have to make an uncomfortable phone call or you know, have a difficult meeting or something, you take your frankincense, same thing, drop under your tongue. I just do them together. I do them in the morning. I make it really simple. Uh, and these two just work unreal. So frankincense, uh, let me explain this to you. I'm going to take a sip of my tea. So we have something called the dura that surrounds our central nervous system. So it surrounds our brain, our spinal cord, and it's the dura matter. And the dura is one of the key components of keeping the cerebral spinal fluid in around the spinal cord and the cere cerebellum, the, the brain, basically. Uh, and it's also one of the key components of keeping things out. So we can't get to our central nervous system. It is a highly protected system in our bodies. Uh, you might have had an epidural when you had a childbirth or a surgery, uh, and you know that they stick a needle through the dura into their cerebral spinal fluid, and then they release medication from there. Now, that's the only way modern medicine can get to 
the cerebral spinal fluid is by puncturing the dura. So there's certain chemical constituents in natural plants and products. Hi, Miss Summer, how are you? There's certain uh, plants or chemical constituents in plants that allow that oil to penetrate the blood brain barrier, that dura, and affect our central nervous system. Uh, frankincense has is high in what we call sesquetropines, and sesquetropines have the ability to penetrate the blood brain barrier and affect the central nervous system. So sometimes those anxious feelings we deal with are highly correlated to some imbalances in our hormones, imbalances in our central nervous system. Even um, maybe you have some concussions or things that have happened to you and you maybe that's triggered some of those anxious feelings for you. Frankincense is so powerful for that. So pop those two under your tongue to start your day. Copaiba and frankincense, right? Get them under your tongue and that will help so much with those anxious feelings. That is going to be one of the key things that you start doing every day. The second thing I recommend for everybody that is dealing with the ongoing anxious anxiousness, right? Uh, and this is good for everybody, is these lifelong vitalities. You've probably heard me talk about these 9 million times. You have your uh, whole food bioavailable vitamins and minerals, your fish oils, fatty acids, omegas, your antioxidants. Uh, this has your turmeric oil, your green tea extract, uh, your pomegranate seed extract, so many amazing things. And this lifelong vitality uh, has proven benefits of general wellness and vitality, antioxidant and DNA protection, energy metabolism, bone health, immune function, stress management, cardiovascular health, healthy hair, skin and nails, eye, brain, nervous system health, liver function, digestive health, lung and respiratory health. It's gentle on the stomach, non-GMO, gluten-free and dairy-free, and we even have a vegan option. These are incredible. These will help so much. I had a friend, I have a friend who had um, a surgery and she was told by her doctor that she needed to go on a specific supplement type. So she went and got the specific supplement type off of the online stores that her doctor recommended. And she tried them. And she called me about two months after and was like, I just don't understand. I feel like all of these anxious feelings have come back. I feel like I've taken so many steps back uh, with just all of that health, like, I, I don't know what to do. And I was like, well, are you still taking your lifelong vitality? No, the doctor said I had to take XYZ. I'm like, okay, well, did you compare XYZ to the lifelong vitality? And then she sat down, compared XYZ to the lifelong vitality and realized that it had all of the same things she needed. She just needed to supplement one thing. And she got back on her lifelong vitality. And within three days, I kid you not, she called me and told me, wow, I feel like myself again. Unreal. So if you deal with that, you definitely need to get on those. Um, so Miss Summer over on Instagram asks, do you know of anything that helps with dehydration? Yeah, I can definitely speak to that in a minute. Um, so I'm actually going to talk about, well, the lifelong vitality is going to help your body function more optimally, which is key. Uh, and then adding lemon to your water is going to help with uh, just the fact that we're going to be absorbing the water better, drinking more water because we have the lemon in the water. So this is another thing I, I recommend with dealing with the anxious feelings. So you add this to your water daily to uplift your mood and flush out toxins. So you can be better hydrated if you have a lower toxic load. Uh, so it just helps flush the body and keep things moving. So I do one to two drops in my big old 40 ounce water bottle that I drink about three times a day. So that's a nice one. A good summary daily, awesome. The other thing for dehydration that I recommend is drinking alkaline water. You actually become more hydrated by drinking alkaline water because our body thrives in an alkaline environment and doesn't do good in an acidic environment. And fortunately, most of our drinking water is acidic. Uh, we have a local company here in San Diego that delivers alkaline water to our door. It's delicious. There is a little detox effect when you first start drinking alkaline water um, if you haven't drank it. So kind of like split it and start feeding it in. And then now once I drink it all the time, that's the only thing I can drink for sure. So alkaline water definitely helps with hydration. Um, so lemon daily for everybody, especially those dealing with anxious feelings. It's going to uplift your mood, keep you happy, and it's throughout the day because you're drinking water throughout the day. Uh, the other supplement I want to mention is pro the PV Assist. This is a probiotic. doTERRA a, has a dual release probiotic. So this probiotic has the outside clear component that releases in your upper GI and the inside green component that releases in your lower GI. Uh, and this is just going to help replenish your gut with healthy flora. So um, what 
I've learned as I've done more research is close to 80% of our serotonin receptors reside in our gut. Serotonin is our happy hormone. So we need serotonin and we need a healthy gut to be absorbing the right amount and, and functioning with the right level of serotonin. So giving your gut something like a probiotic is really going to help you feel better. So I take that lifelong vitality back with that um, probiotic every single day. You're so welcome, Summer. I hope that helps. I, um, I can help you find a alkaline water distributor too where you live. Summer lives where I grew up, so I can help her out. Okay, so the next thing I want to talk about are some oils that you can use. In these, The ones we talked about now, like the cobayiba, frankincense, lemon, uh, lifelong vitality, PBSS, these are all going to be things that you're going to just be doing as a daily regimen to keep yourself healthy and to help manage those anxious feelings. Now we need some things that we can do to use when things come up right? When we're feeling a little overwhelmed or, or those anxious feelings are coming up. So we have lavender. Lavender is all things calming. So one of the best things you can do, I have on my notes here, apply to the chest and breathe in daily to help decrease those feelings and diffuse as well. So one of the things I like to do is I like to take a drop of lavender. I take three slow breaths just like that. And then I'll put that on my chest so I can continue to smell that. Hi, how are you over there on Instagram? Um, so I like to just do that and it's really relaxing. If you're at work, I like to add a little peppermint to that, okay? So peppermint is great with that lavender for that calming effect, but also you can still stay focused and have energy. So you can do that combination is super key. I love that combo. Uh, so the other thing that you can even add to that combo in what we call our calm and focus blend is our frankincense. So you have your frankincense, lavender, and peppermint. Uh, and you can make a roller bottle, make a 5 ml roller bottle, and just do five drops each, frankincense, lavender, peppermint. Roll that on the back of your neck, along your spine, bottom of your feet, on your chest. It's really calming but really helps with focus and attention at work. So that's a nice one when you're at school or work and you need some support with that. Um, some other things that you can do daily to have a little support is make this roller. It's our liquid calm roller. So it's balance and serenity. Mm, I love these two. Your restful sleep or calming blend. And then serenity or balance is your grounding blend. These two together in a roller, 5 ml, 5 drops each. You're going to fill it with fractionated coconut oil. Apply that to the heart and pulse points, so inside your wrists, inside of your elbows, on your chest, behind your ears, back of your neck, whatever works for you. And you're going to keep that in your hand for when those feelings start to pop up. So maybe you deal with these anxious feelings more frequently and you tend to reach for a prescription at that point. Uh, I recommend then reaching for these two, your liquid calm, and rolling that on, taking a few deep breaths, drinking some lemon water, maybe even taking an extra drop of frankincense under your tongue. Uh, so those are great combos for that. Breathe is also good. Uh, for me, when those anxious feelings come up, it's right here. I feel like I have an elephant on my chest and I can't breathe. I'll take this breathe and I'll put it right on my chest or I'll put it in the diffuser. Uh, the only thing I warn you about with breathe is uh, it has lemon in it. So if you put it on your chest and then go out in the sun, it can make you sensitive to the sun and uh, you don't want that. So be careful with that. But this is a great one for people. Uh, and then the last oil I want to mention is wild orange. So wild orange is, it's just happy. It makes you so happy. It's so delicious. You can take wild orange and put it in your water, breathe it in, take that in your hands, take those three deep breaths, rub it into your, your chest. This doesn't make you sensitive to the sun like other citrus oils, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, just like I showed you, I do the lavender and peppermint. I love to also do the wild orange and peppermint. Uh, and I've also been known to take this amazing veggie cap, just like bye-bye overwhelm. And you, you take uh, wild orange, frankincense, and lavender. So these three bad boys, where are we? There we go. So you're taking those three. Uh, and in a veggie cap, you're going to just take two drops each. So I'll show you what that kind of looks like just so you can see me fill one. So you take your veggie cap. And you just go like this, about 45 degrees, and you drop those drops in. One, two. I got three. Oops. So you do your wild orange, you do your frankincense, you do your lavender, you close it up, 
Okay? And then you take it. Just like a pill. Super simple, super easy. Uh, so that would be a veggie cap that you can use. Um, you can take that multiple times a day. Your rule of thumb is you don't want to exceed 24 drops internally of any one single oil. Because uh, other words, you just kind of start to lose the benefit of it. So um, you can do that a couple times a day, no problem. And you just can't pre-make those veggie caps. That's the only bummer. So those would be my best recommendations for anybody that deals with anxious feelings, anxious overwhelm, um, those occasional ones are the more frequent. Uh, I definitely recommend having that consistent daily routine and then having some of those tools in your back pocket, like the common focus blend, the liquid calm, um, or those bye-bye overwhelm veggie caps and just being ready to use them. So uh, if you have your essential oils, that is awesome. Go ahead and grab them, start using them. If you have a friend that you know deals with this stuff, just go ahead and reach out to them and say, I have something I want you to try. Have them try it. Um, if you haven't gotten started with essential oils, there's some amazing starter kits that you can start with. Uh, I definitely recommend the Natural Solutions Kit as a lifestyle makeover. So this is the kit right here. Uh, this is going to have everything I mentioned except the Copaiba. So you can add the Copaiba on or you can get started with everything else. Um, but this is a real lifestyle makeover. This is really going to be something that's going to just reboot your home, get rid of toxins, make you feel so healthy and happy. Uh, and then the other two kits are our top 10 oils kits. So you have this one that has the large bottles, 15 milliliters, about 250 drops. That's the home essentials. Or you have this one that has the small bottles, 5 milliliter, about 85 drops or servings. Um, and the large bottles are 275, the small bottles are 150. Um, and they are both great places to start. So if you know somebody that needs to get started with these oils, or maybe you need to get started with these oils, let me know. If you're not working with someone, I'd love to help you. If you are working with someone, go back to them and say, hey, I just watched this broadcast and I want to get started with some of these oils. Uh, or if you know somebody that needs these, connect them with me or get them started yourself and and have, help them live a healthier, happier life. Uh, this is super great to um, to empower people that deal with some of this stuff ongoing. So we don't want to have anybody we know dealing with that, right? Um, lastly, keep your eyes peeled. Uh, my podcast is launching uh, September 6th. It's going to be called Natural Wellness Tips. I'm super excited. So um, I can't wait. Keep your eyes peeled for any more information on my podcast launch. Uh, Instagram, you'll have this recording for a day. And Facebook, it'll be in my video section. So come back and watch it. And I hope that answers some of your guys' questions and helps you feel like you can tackle the day a little bit better.